the biggest pain points at EV charging stations, plus Google saying goodbye to Chromecast. Rich Jamiro here with more in Rich on Tech. Good morning. Hey, good morning to you guys. You know, there's a whole website dedicated to all of the products and services that Google has killed over the years. Oh, wow. But you got to give them credit because they try a lot of new things. This one was very successful, but they are still shutting it down. After 11 years and 100 million devices sold, Google ending production of Chromecast. The simple dongle made it easy to stream audio and video to TVs just by plugging the device into an HDMI port and using your phone as a remote control. Now, since its release, of course, streaming apps and set-top boxes have taken over, but casting will live on since it's built into millions of TVs and Android streaming devices, including a new set-top box from Google called the Google TV Streamer 4K. Say that 10 times. <laughs> <laughs> the new $100 device has better performance, a remote control with a finder, uh, and AI to help you find stuff to watch. This will be available on September 24th. So basically they've said, you know what? The box is the way of the future. That's what people want. We've got Roku, we've got Fire, we've got yeah. Apple TV. Google has to have their own. Now we have it. One of the best flight tracking apps has a new AI powered feature that helps predict when your flight might be delayed even before your airline knows. Flighty, arguably the best and most beautifully designed flight tracking app. It launched in 2019 and this new feature uses machine learning to predict delays caused by late aircraft, weather, ground stops, congestion and even taxiing delays. This can help predict delays up to six hours before airlines announce them. Wow. This way you can have a heads up on rebooking and rescheduling. And in my case, I just turn the car around and head back home and wait for a little bit longer. You know, you've well, ever, well sometimes but it's I'd, not a guarantee, right? It's just a prediction. It's just a prediction, but probably pretty good. Oh, okay. I know that's the tough part is with all these delay predictions, it's like, do you sit at home and wait? But if you miss your flight, that's yeah, no problem. See. Uh, right now, Flighty is on Apple devices only. There is a free level, but this is part of the pro subscription, which is $48 a year. And a new report reveals why electric cars and charging them can still be a pain. The Charger Help study looked at 20,000 non-Tesla EV charging stations in the U.S., and they found that broken chargers aren't properly reported a lot of the time. Apps also give the wrong info about whether a charger is working. Some older chargers are already breaking down, and certain charging networks are more reliable than others. The study found that chargers uh, only work about 74% of the time. The biggest issues, broken cables, damaged screens, and payments that won't accept. The study concluded that there needs to be more back and forth between apps and charging networks. Can you just can you see a time? Do you want to promote yourself? Richontech.tv if you want links to any of those, <laughs> including that flighty app. Yeah, yeah. I'm telling you. You use it? I love that app. I it's mean, it's pretty accurate. It's amazing. Wow. I mean, it, down to the seconds, it counts down on your phone till landing. Oh, wow. So, like, literally, I, I've been on the plane, and it's like five, four, three, two, one, touchdown. No oh, way. Like, I mean, maybe within 30 seconds or nice. something. Wow. It's, it's pretty cool. Very nice. nice. Uh, my question was this Do you see a time where gas stations are replaced by EV charging stations? Ooh, fighting words there. Uh, you know what? I don't know. I, I think that gas right now they're kind of like located in these like little off the beat. Yeah. Paths yeah. Files. Oh, you mean like will the charging station be the gas station? Yeah. I'm actually still surprised gas stations are not putting charging stations uh -huh. in. Um, we just saw a couple in the south do that. Mm -hmm. But I, I don't know. Yeah. Seems like a no brainer. Right? Seems like Tesla kind of has their own thing going. Yeah. So I don't know. You still yeah. got to like go to the roof of a mall. <laughs> you know, it's yeah, like, what, like, it makes no sense. Yeah. I had to pay for parking one time at a mall in, or, in order to charge. Yeah. yeah I was like, funny. certainly this is wrong. No, it was right. Yeah. Like that's the way it was.